guys, it's Juliana, and I'm back with the Talos Principle. Um, and yeah, so I'm right where we left off this time, um, after getting that, so I think I should probably, you know, quit while I'm ahead with the reds, but I'm not gonna. I probably should. And, uh, so, uh, I just don't know. Like, I feel like pushed my luck today, and that doesn't normally go well. These sigils are becoming harder to reach. I dread uh, what the next temple holds in store. And at the end, what? Eternal life? There's got to be another way. Uh, sheet B69.1.0435. Uh, probably not eternal life. I would I would highly doubt that sort of thing. Um, Elohim does not seem one to just give that stuff away. Um, Right. Okay. Can I see that one from you? Yep. Okay. I think that should solve the problem of being, like, you know, things crossing. Because now I should be able to... Yes. Wah ha 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 ha. Okay. Sorry that took so long. It's a little bit of a pain. Yay! All right, now for the easy ones, right? Oh, look, notes. Seek those in this world that would help you. Though only one of us can transcend, we will all share both 
in both the burden and the rewards. The shepherd V82.4.62. Six two three two. You've changed uh dog V fifty five point one point four three one one. Everything I do now I do for those who come after me. Yet in so doing I find peace for myself as well. This paradox is a found is the foundation of my existence. The shepherd V eighty two point four point six two three two. Was that one point four? Yeah, that was point four. Okay. Just take it. Ah. Okay. Um. Well, what's out here then? It's been a while since we've had like an actual area beyond play in a while. Don't go into the water. You kind of, you kind of go sparkly. Oh look, another terminal. Beep boop boop beep. Oh. A problem that's been detected and uh, Windows has been shut down to prevent damage to your computer. The problem seems to be caused by the following file SP SPCMDCON.sys <clears throat> page fault in non paged area. If this is the first time you've seen this, then s this error screen restart your computer if this screen appears again follow these steps check to make sure any new hardware or software is properly installed if this is a new installation ask your hardware or software manufacturer for any windows updates you might need if problem continues disable and regularly installed hardware or software disable bios memory <clears throat> options such as caching or shadowing if you need to use a safe mode to remove or disable components and restart your computer, press F8 and select advanced startup options and then and then select save mode, technical information STOP 0x00000050 I'm not going to keep reading that um, interesting, so we've got some errors in the system. Alright, so, back to it. Um, what is this one? I have read a message on the wall that speaks of a world of endless sand. I, I would like to see if... I would like to make it far enough to see that. At V seventeen point one point zero zero five four. Okay. I have yet to see that one, but that's cool. Okay. Alright, inwards we go. Trapped inside. Okay. hard at all. Aww. The fresco is back. Okay. I'm not missing anything, am I, guys? Hopefully not. As I go into the labyrinth.
done with gate 7 for A. And... Or no, we're done. Holy crap. Wow. Okay. I'm a little shocked at that. Oh, look, a new QR code. I had a full-blown conversation with the entity in the archive today. I can't say it was terribly helpful, but still, perhaps I can charm some information out of it further down the line. Chief B69.1.4825. Alright, and everything's closed here. Except the star, which I still haven't quite figured out. That's where the blue thing is. I'll try and suss that out later. I might need help with that, honestly. Like. Wait. Okay. Um. That was seven. Oh crap, that's everything. Um, I guess I either need to continue with the red ones, or that can just wait until I actually have something of value in B. So I think I'm gonna head on over to B. Um, I might start something over there, I might not. Uh, depends on where we're at when I get over there. Boop, boop. So let's see how many we have here. We also have seven here plus whatever. Um, let's hit this. Mountain Library Assistant done. Initiating language interface done. Support session open. Hello again. I would like to take a few moments to complete a short user satisfaction survey regarding the certification program you really recently undertook. Okay. Um, oh, would you? Yeah, sure. Based on an analysis of your behavior since I would, I think you were dissatisfied with the results of the certification program. How would you rate the accuracy of the result out of five? Reasonable. Um, excellent. What best describes the reason for your investment in the certification um, program's outcome. Why does being a person matter to you? Uh, the persons matter. Uh, I want network access. It's the truth. Persons matter in other ways. In ways other things don't. I want to find out if I am one. Wait. We're having a conversation now? Um... I'll try to remember that. In fact, I'm going to help you. That's what I'm here for. Your problem, if I may, is that you don't know the first thing about anything, including what a person is. Your prospects, therefore, are poor. Do you need even know what you are? Um, <laughs> uh, do you even know where you are? Sorry. Um, could be anywhere. You're quite right. Honest, too. I think we best start from scratch. What do you know? Um, I know. You exist, I know I exist. I know what century I am. I know <laughs> I know I exist. I think, therefore, I am. I suppose so. Even if you were dreaming, you could... I suppose so. Even if you were dreaming, you could be certain of that. If I were you, I wouldn't believe a darn thing in this place aside from that solidarity affecting 
On reflection, this seems to me that you are no closer to resolving your problem. Perhaps we need more data. What makes you think you are a poor person? I'm alive, I feel. I am conscious. I'm having this conversation with you. The same thing that makes you think you are, I don't see how I can convince you. Um. I am alive, I feel, I am conscious. You may very well say so, but how does that prove anything? To me, there are only words on the screen. What we need to uncover about what's going on underneath them, if anything, thank you. Um, the problem with people, if I may be so bold, is that you, you're all convinced you're people from the inside but there's no cast iron way to confirm as much on the outside. I'm going to process this and send you a notification when I'm able to assist you further. Terminating support session done. Resuming library archive. List searching locally for cached resources. Web crawl 2022-0701. Web crawl, or sorry. Um, Oracaris? Hold on. Ocaris Rhinocus. Ocaris Rhinocus? I'm not really sure about that one. Um, that HTML. Um, and then web crawl 20320904, book of Osiris.wiki. Uh, the great irony of the Arachniris papyri is that. Such a vital source of information about the ancient world exists only because of a garbage dump. Um, while the Library of Alexandria burned at the hands of fanatics and conquerors, depriving us of unimaginable insight into history, philosophy, and art, the papers carelessly thrown away by citizens of Ukraine survived to the modern day. And though it's true that a great deal of what we know today is because of conscious efforts of individuals and organizations such as uh, the spectacular translation and preservation of works done during the Islamic Golden Age, so much more is simply the result of coincidence and luck. We've lost texts that the ancients considered to be absolutely essential while other utterly trivial, even plagiarized work has survived unharmed. Lots of hacks here. Um, so if we want our descendants to remember more than glittering emo vampires and auto-tuned teen pop stars, we have to invest in uh, error, making sure that error, not untrue. Uh, the Book of Osiris Wiki. Uh, the Book of the Scribe of Osiris, sometimes also referred to as the Book of the Journey to Aru, Aru is um, an ancient virgin, ancient Egyptian text discovered in the excavation of Okorinus. It is, it has caused a certain degree of controversy among Egyptologists, as some argue that it's. A classic funerary text such as the Book of the Coming Forth of the Day, while others believe it to be a poetic work not intended to be understood literally, the book tells the story of a dying man who asks a scribe about the afterlife. The scribe, a servant of Osiris, describes how the man's ka, the life force, will become separated from his ba personality, and how he will have he will have to reunite the two and become an ankh living intellect, uh, pa uh, passing a series of trials in the Duat underworld uh, in order to reach the paradise of Aru. Um, unlike similar texts, the book of the scribe of Osiris focuses less on giving advice or error. Recent studies, um, Karnan Hassan suggest the text may have been intended as a philosophical commentary on the world of the living through the allegory of the Duat. It remains unclear whether it was the intent of the original pre-Alexandrian author or the result of later 
translation into Greek, the earlier manuscript, which is considered to be more uh, authentic, is too fragmentary to provide answers. Though perhaps for, uh, through further excavation may error. Okay. We. All right, so we've opened this and down we go. And I think that's as far as we're gonna get today. And I did explore up A there, but that's land okay. stands before you, my child. And know that this is a land of death, but also great beauty. As you walk amongst these tombs, consider all those who came before you and how they serve the greater purpose of which you are also part. Okay, so obviously we already knew we were going to Egypt, but now we know we're going to Egypt. Um, we're kind of there. So, all right. Uh, let's, I'm just going to head on to one. Um, and hope for the best. Because, does it have what we need? It does indeed. So, I'm heading on to one and... I have I'm... promised you eternal life. But know that eternity may only be attained by those who serve a purpose greater than themselves. All else is decay. So it was written in the hidden words before the beginning of time. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, uh, and leave a comment down below letting me know if I'm doing it wrong. Um, I will see you next time. Bye.